Mr. Beast currently has world fastest YouTube channel. And if you notice his thumbnail, you can see his face is so much polished in his every thumbnail. And if you're wondering how can you also get that kind of same effect for your image, in this video, I'm going to show all the process. This video is going to walk you through all the process, what you can do to get that kind of same effect so that you can also get that kind of editing effect for your thumbnail easily. So without talking too much, let's start the video. Now for first, I go to Google and search for Mr. Beast image. I did to find a very shocking image that he used on his thumbnail, but I didn't able to find. But finally, I got this image to use to show you all the process. Now you can see I have downloaded the images. Now first, I take the image and go to Photoshop. After opening the Photoshop, first we need to remove the background. Now there is two ways you can do that. You can use the quick selection tool or you can use pen tool. In a professional way, I always try to go with the pen tool. So I'm going to use the pen tool and make a path. After creating the path, we need to make that path into selection. To do that, first press the right button on your mouse and make a selection. Be sure to make the further into zero and hit OK. And then apply a layer mask. Now we need to create a background for that. I'm going to create a black background. To do that, first create a blank layer. Take the blank layer into the bottom of the main Mr. Beast layer and then go to edit, fill and take the black. After creating the black, you can see there is so much halos and white parts that need to be removed. To do that, we're going to use a smudge tool. Take the smudge tool and also be sure to select the layer mask and then apply the smudge tool into the deep area and create that same effect like me. After removing the halos, now the next step is to create a smooth skin. To do the smooth skin, before we need to just remove some of the ankle and also spot face spot that have Mr. Beast. So you can follow my steps and easily create that by using the spot links and also the paste tool. After that, make a duplicate layer. Then press Ctrl plus I to create invert and also use the blending mode into vivid light. And after that, go to the filter, others, high pass. Use a high pass that shows the skin smoothly and be sure to remove the red part and hit OK. And then again, go to the filter, blur, Gaussian blur and adjust the Gaussian blur properly to create that. Now adjust the Gaussian Blur to adjust the skin properly. The next step is apply a negative layer mask. Select the blur layer, then press Alter option on your keyboard and apply a layer mask and you can see it's apply a negative layer mask. And then select the layer mask, take the brush tool, be sure to the white in the foreground and reduce the opacity around 50% uh, and then again apply that smooth into the skin. After applying the smoothness into the skin, the next step is to apply a dodge and burn. And there is a two way you can apply the dodge and burn. First is destructive way and second the non-destructive way. There is a two way you can apply the dodge and burn. The dodge and burn tool or you can also use the curve adjustment. For my case, I am going to use the curve tool. And first, make the curve brighter. And again go to the adjustment and take the curve adjustment 
and now this time make the curve into dark. And then select the layer mask and take the brush tool and apply the certain area to give the dungeon burn. And do the same thing and follow the step and create the dodge and burn and apply the dodge and burn in the certain area that makes a uh, dodge and burn and the highlight area like the Mr. Beast has. And also we need to adjust the eye area and also the teeth area so be sure to follow that and also apply that white into the eye and teeth properly. And finally by retouching the eye I'm going to apply a blue color into the eye so that just go to the adjustment layer take a solid color take a blue color and then change the black and then change the blending mode into color and again invert the layer mask and go to the closer and apply the color into the eye area and finally you can see we are done and we create the same effect that Mr. Beast apply in his every thumbnail by using a simple method.